so welcome again welcome to another tutorial welcome to another customized pillows tutorial so the earnest uh, tutorial is you know you know how to print on this i've taught you how to print on this so sometimes after making this um, picture you just want maybe you don't want the background like this maybe you don't want the but or you just want the picture to be there alone so you can trim it out so this picture now i'm going to be trimming it out i'm going to be trimming it out you trim it very well i'm going to be trimming it out so but when you are trimming make sure you are trimming it well make sure you are trimming it properly so i want it to i want the picture to be like this Going to be trimming it. Trim, trim, trim like this. You need to check my other videos on customized strip pillows to understand yeah. this also better. I've uploaded videos on introduction to strip pillow where. I explain all the materials needed where you will get them. So this is like the part three of a uh, customized straw pillow. Please, I want you to check my other videos to be able to understand better. Then also, I will drop the link in the description box below, and I will also pin it in the comment section. You can just go ahead and check them for better understanding. I've traced it out from the air. So I'm done tracing it out. I have removed the back part, the opaque part. So I removed this one too. So this is how I want to place it. Just be creative about this thing. So this is how I want to place it. So you see? Then I'll just put my Teflon. My iron is very hot. I'll just place my iron on it like this. An iron. The edges, make sure you iron the edges very well. Pay attention to, to the edges. done attaching this one now so I, I i don't want to stop here i want to put some other things so i want to use this glitter this glitter so what i want to do is i want to create love i want to create love shape just pick any paper either brown paper or anything just then fold it it depends on how many uh love shape you want to create so i just want to show you how to create love fold your love make sure the edges here is like this i don't want a big one so so from here just put it on like this to create love shape love shape just go like that like that go off your hand mm. so when it gets here just go inside and get it these are to create love shape so we have our love shape here ready so this is love depending on how many you want so after creating love shape so, or any shape, you can create over shape, any shape you want. Yeah. Just place it on it like this. Mm. Place it on it like this. Yeah, you see? Mm. Then 
then you can either use your cutter to cut it i'm going to be using my this is my cutter to cut it hmm? i'll just use it to trim it out just like this or if you don't want to use cutter you can also use your your scissors to cut it but when you are cutting you need to be very careful so that it will be very smooth hmm? so cut Just trim it, just trim the shape out. So just trim the shape out like that so i'm done trimming out so this is it so i'll just place it here mm -hmm. so the first another thing you're going to do now is to remove this there is a paper here there is nylon here mm -hmm. i'm going to remove the nylon so you just remove this Cut any shape of any shape you want, any design you want. In fact, you can even write "I love you" here. I love you. You can write something like that. Then this is it. So I'm going to be placing it, placing them here. I'll just position them the way I want them to be. So I'm okay the way it is here like this. So I just position it. Hmm. So I want it to be like this. Then I just pick my Teflon and place it on it like this. And with my hot iron, place it on it and iron. Gently iron it and make sure you stick to it.
so I'm satisfied with it now and it's thick it's very very sticky now mm. very very stick to it so so this is how to put your glitter here on it this is how to put your glitter on it so I'll just fix the pillow inside. So this is the finished look. The finished look. So beautiful. So you can create any design that you want. You can use the glitter to create. In fact, like you know I trimmed this picture from this, this. From this uh, opaque paper. You know I trimmed it. So this one you can still use it to make any design. Like, see what I did to this uh, mug. So, it was one, one of the pictures that I trimmed out. So, I just used part of it to make love shape. And I put it on my mug to customize it. And I just put, uh, 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 I just designed it with this stone. So, that's it. So, you can use this. If you have this picture now, you can also use it to create something on your mug so we are going to be using this picture to create on our mug so we've come to the end of this class also so see you in next class thank you and god bless you